Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is a Magic Review. Hey, today we're gonna to look at Unbelievelope from Jeff Kalor. What is it, uh, Unbelievelope? It's a prediction envelope. Uh, magician has an uh, envelope on stage with him. Uh, it's got a full transparent window where the spectator can clearly see the object inside. And then through a magical presentation or a routine, uh, you're able to reveal that what is in the envelope is exactly what you predicted. Would you like to see it? This is Unbelievelope. Introducing the Unbelievelope by Jeff Kaler. The Unbelievelope is a specially engineered envelope that allows you to predict future events or make cards travel through space and time. Imagine handing a spectator an envelope with a written prediction seen inside. Randomly chosen audience members freely name anything, favorite foods, destinations, celebrities, dates, or any personal information only they would know. Then, unbelievably, you reveal those exact details in your prediction. Or, your envelope can clearly display a single playing card in full view. Then, any card from any deck is signed and lost in the shuffle. Again, unbelievably, the card that is visibly removed from the envelope is the card just signed by the spectator. To be clear, this is an envelope with an almost full front window that's designed to switch any object that's in full view under seemingly impossible conditions. You'll get over an hour of professional instruction that teaches multiple applications, plus several custom-designed, high-quality, unbelievables that can replace prediction systems that cost thousands of dollars without needing a secret assistant. So, if you're looking for something to close your show that packs small but can entertain from two to 2,000 people, and who isn't, then you need Jeff Kaler's Unbelievable. Brought to you by the Magic Estate. All right, so that was Jeff Kaler. Uh, you might remember he did TKO, he did any card to any spectator's wallet. Uh, this uh, Unbelievable Oak was published by Magic Estate. All right, so what I liked about it, uh, what I liked about this is Jeff gives you three envelopes. That's pretty cool. Uh, usually when you get a gaff or utility, you get one, and then you get the instructions, you know, how to make another one. But Jeff's actually giving you three, and they're really sturdy, so they're gonna last you a really long time. Um, he does also tell you how to make more, and so I think that in itself is a, a really great property to this effect. All right, so a couple of questions we always ask about all of our magic reviews. The first of which is, what's in the box? Hey, what's in the box? Uh, you're gonna get a cardboard sleeve, Inside the cardboard sleeve, there's a link to a website. The website contains all the video links uh, for you to watch and learn how to use the gimmick. And like I said, you're gonna get three gimmicks. Uh, this is done in a very old school uh, presentation. It's all done up in a sealed Ziploc bag. I can remember going into magic stores when I was a kid and every magic trick was in a sealed Ziploc bag with a piece of paper instructions and the gimmick inside. And this is what you're kind of getting with Unbelievable. The only addition is the website link isn't a link to download videos, it's a link to watch videos. And, and what Jeff is doing is he's uploading new videos all the time. And so depending on when you purchase Unbelievable, you're always gonna get the latest information. Not only are you getting tricks, you're getting tips, you're getting idea jams, you're getting uh, the instructions on how to make your own Unbelievable, and as well as using Unbelievable with other tricks like TKO or gaff cards. Uh, it's a really great way, very modern way, to do uh, the video for this magic effect. All right, so is it what I thought? Uh, not exactly. I really didn't know what to think from watching the video. I had a couple of ideas, but I was wrong on all of them. And the idea of using a prediction envelope, that's not necessarily an original idea. I mean, at first glance, this trick might look like David Regal's special delivery or Paul Romney's uh, dream prediction. Uh, the idea, though, behind the envelope or the gimmick, uh, kind of in this fashion, is originally a Sam Berland and Roger Kerr on effect. Uh, Jeff certainly is drawing inspiration, I think, from all of those creators, 
but uh, we would want you to know that Jeff has their permission and their blessing. And I think that what he's done in this is actually taken that idea and kind of brought it forward and uh, really gives you something that I think you can use time and time again and that really looks magical. It's also true that the idea behind the Unbelief Elope and even its description, uh, Jeff goes over in his TKO DVD and so if you have that, um, I think you certainly have uh, part of this already. Uh, obviously you don't get uh, the prop uh, with the TKO DVD and you do get it with this. And so maybe you saw it in TKO and always wanted one uh, for yourself. This is certainly your opportunity to do that. All right, so how are the angles? Uh, the angles of this are really good. Uh, but again, I would argue that this trick is gonna work best on stage. It's gonna work best in parlor. Obviously you're not gonna wanna have anyone behind you. Uh, there's some dirty work that you have to do but uh, I think the angles on it as far as straight ahead and on your sides is really good. All right, so can it be inspected? Uh, this is the envelope right here. Uh, and like I'm saying, you know, if you're doing this on stage, if you're doing this for parlor, uh, no one's gonna ask to inspect your props. And so like we always say around here, gimmicks and gaffs are not to be inspected. This is definitely a gaff envelope, uh, but I don't think it will draw any heat due to how natural it looks. All right, so what are the overall quality and production values of the videos that you watch? Uh, they're all really well shot. They're done in HD. You get lots of multiple angles. Uh, Jeff's microphone. Uh, you're getting just tons and tons and tons of teaching and ideas. I think what you're getting uh, with this, especially Jeff's creative idea of having all the videos available for you on the web, is certainly uh, giving you the best of the best. All right, so is the envelope well made? Uh, it is very well made. It's a very thick, very sturdy cardstock. Uh, the window transparency is exactly what you'd expect to see in uh, you know, any business envelope that comes to your house. Um, it's solid, it's weighty. Um, you're not gonna damage or uh, mess with your corners. Uh, if you keep it in a good condition, I think this prop is gonna last you a very long time. All right, so how much practice does it require? Uh, there's definitely gonna be some practice with the switch out. You're gonna have to practice um, exchanging one item for the other. Um, but I think most of your practice with this is gonna come just from presentation. You know, I think most of us as magicians, uh, that's the part that we spend the least amount of time on, but it really should be the most, you know, going over our routine, going over our pattern, making it look natural, making it look like uh, our dirty work or our moves aren't moves at all. So I think the majority of your practice should be done in presentation and pattern. All right, so how much setup and reset is there? Uh, there is some, but only in the amount of time that it would take to put something in or take something out of an envelope. All right, so positives. Positives for Unbelievable, look how big that window is. That is a ginormous, uh, envelope window and I think it certainly sets your spectators, sets your crowd at ease that they can clearly see the prediction. And I think that in the couplements with the fact that they see your fingers reach in and slide the object out, I think it's a beautiful illusion and I think that is really what sells this wonderful effect. All right, so some negatives. You know, like we say around here, there's negatives with every single magic trick. These are just the negatives I see. They don't have to be the negatives that you see. Um, there are some arts and crafts. Even though Jeff is giving you three envelopes, uh, there's some cut and paste that has to get done, and he's leaving that on you. And so, you know, I never like arts and crafts. I never like spending money on an effect and then having to take a knife to it. <laughs> I always feel like, oh no, what if I, you know, mess up? So there are some arts and crafts, just a uh, forewarning, uh, and so that's really my only negative. All right, so is it worth your money? Uh, it's 40 bucks. It's 40 bucks. You get all that instructional teaching and you're gonna get three gimmicks, and this is something that you could basically close your act with. This is something that you could have on stage and is big enough to be the finale of your routine. 40 bucks is nothing. This is definitely worth your money. This is totally affordable. And if you're doing anything on stage, I, even if you're doing kids magic on stage, I think that there's definitely room for this in your arsenal. All right, so who would like this? Uh, stage magicians, mentalists, working professionals certainly could use this. Uh, I definitely think people uh, could use this for walk around. Uh, they could use this for close up, but I think the envelope, uh, the prop itself is kind of large. And just because of some of the angle issues, I think it would work better for people who work on stage. All right, so that is Unbelievable from Jeff Kaler and Magic Estate. And if you'd like to purchase your own, you can find it at one of your favorite Murphy's Magic suppliers.